kids. I'm Miss Judy, and our word of the day is martyr. Martyr. M as in mommy, A as in astronaut, R as in rainbow, T as in tennis, Y as in yoga, and another R as in rhinoplasty. <laughs> Let's open our textbooks. Arabic, third edition, for fifth graders. The martyr we're studying today is Dalal al Maghrabi, also known as the Bride of Jaffa. She was one of the leaders of the 1978 Coastal Road Massacre in Israel. The massacre resulted in the deaths of 38 Israeli civilians, including 13 children. According to Time magazine, she wanted to kill as many Israelis as possible. So, Dalal and her group sailed their ship towards the beach. Who likes the beach? I love the beach. When Dalal and her friends landed on the shore, they looked around and they realized they didn't know where they were. Oh, Have you ever gotten lost? Oh, yes. It's scary. Yes. But Miss Judy has taught you that whenever you get lost, all you need to do is ask an adult for help. Lucky for Dalal and her friends, they spotted a photographer who was taking nature photos on the beach. Her name was Gail Rubin and she grew up in New York City. Have you ever visited New York City? Yeah. Dalal asked her where they were and Gail told them that they were 40 miles away from where they wanted to be. Then Dalal killed her. Gail was only 40 <laughs> years old. I know that seems old to you, but believe me kids, it's not. <laughs> When Talal and her friends reached the highway, they hijacked a taxi and two passenger buses. As the bus neared the city of Herzliya, a fierce battle took place. Hours later, the battle ended. The bus had been blown up, along with everyone inside of it. Dalal al Mugrabi was killed in the clash, and that is why she is a martyr. Now you know the story of Dalal al Maghrabi. I hope you enjoyed today's story. And now for your homework assignment. Please write a one-page essay single-spaced about what you learned today. Some questions you should answer in your writing include, where did Dalal and her friends land? What was the purpose of Dalal's mission? And a special assignment for just the girls. Palestinian women have a role in resisting the occupier. How is that manifested in the text? Would you like to be a martyr when you grow up? Well, kids, that's all for today with Miss Judy. Visit unlearnhate.org to see more real examples from Palestinian textbooks.